What is up everybody? It's your girl Stephanie and thanks for joining me again. And if you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Steph. And on this channel we talk about everything fragrance. And you guys, I'm sorry for the horrible lighting that's in here. The, I wanted to film this video on a whim because this is probably one of the worst fragrances I've ever smelled. I don't want to gift it to anybody because I just think this smells awful. But Fragrantica swayed me into purchasing this one and because I found it at an affordable deal on Amazon, that is exactly why I picked it up. This is terrible. I feel like all those like 10 out of 10 reviews saying that this is beautiful and delicious and caramel and like smooth and creamy, like none of that seem to be the case for this fragrance. The fragrance that I'm talking about, you guys, and it's from Crown Parfums and it's called Dalal. Let me and it's from Al Alahab Perfumes or Al Rahab Perfumes. You guys, I'm literally my stomach is turning knowing that I'm gonna spray this for you guys and describe it. I bought this for six dollars, you guys. Okay, and I was like, you know what? And I never liked Juicy Couture Gold Couture. I felt like it all, like I always thought that it smelled musty or like armpitty. Like I, you guys are gonna come for me because I know a lot of people love Juicy Couture Gold Couture, but I, there's this, there's this thing in that fragrance that I cannot stand and I pick it up in this as well. Anyways, let's spray this. This is what the bottle looks like. It is sweet. Let's see. One spray, you guys. I cannot. It's not. Okay. There is a sweetness. There is like a caramel-like quality to this. But it's as if somebody sweaty, kind of musty, sprayed on a sweet caramel-like fragrance. And that's kind of the same thing that I get with Juicy Couture Gold Couture. There's something a little bit sugary. I think it's the caramel and vanilla that's in this. Like an or orange, something like that. There has to be like some sort of orange note. Like a sweet caramelly orange. But there's like this musty dirtiness around it no like I literally feel like gagging I know that I'm like probably there's because this literally had so many great reviews you guys and for six bucks I was gonna be like I was genuinely hoping to love this I was genuinely hoping to be like you guys this is one of the best cheapies out there you know, I thought I was going to discover gold, okay? But, well, no, no, no. This literally makes me cringe. And I wanted to include it in my giveaway, you guys, but I don't want any of you guys to smell this bad. So, do I recommend this? No. Do I, maybe I got a bad bottle or something? Or maybe it's just supposed to be cheap perfume. But either way, you guys, I don't recommend this. I don't know what to do with it. I don't want to throw it away. I feel like it's a waste of perfume. No, baby, I don't even want you smelling like this. I definitely do not recommend this fragrance right here. If you happen to stumble across this one, don't. Don't do it, girl. Don't do it, girl. For real. Do um, if you like this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe down below and activate that bell so you're notified for future videos. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Take care and stay smelling good. Oh, I can still smell it. Okay, bye.